Ink Story is an exhibit celebrating our 30th anniversary of Ang Ilustrador ng Kabataan, which is the Philippines' first and only organization dedicated to the creation and promotion of illustration for children. Hello, I'm Nina Martinez and I am the president of Ang Ilustrador ng Kabataan in this year 2021. When you come into our exhibit, you're going to see a timeline about ink starting from when we were founded in 1991. From when we were declared an organization, to the executive board, to the ink logo being born. It was designed by Endo Pascasio and you can see him right here. His name is Pen Pen and he's going to follow us around for our exhibit today. When you look at the timeline, just look up and you'll be able to see works new and original by our various members. For this exhibit, we asked our members to create new works um, with the prompt, What is your ink story? For some, they interpreted this as, what was your experience in our organization? For others, they interpreted it as, what was your journey as an illustrator? So you get to see a diverse array of works from people with very personal stories or people celebrating what they've been able to do with our organization as their support. What's interesting is that members from different generations came to participate. So you're going to see here on the captions, Inky since 2020 or Inky since 1994. So people from every year of the organization came to celebrate. If you look here, you're going to see the papers from the workshop that started it all. A few illustrators were invited to a workshop by Goethe Institute run by Reinhard Mikkel, who was a distinguished German illustrator for children's books. There wasn't a plan to make an organization at the time. It was to just learn from a master. And yet, the members there, realizing they had common goals and common ideas, decided to create Ang Ilustrador ng Kabataan. You can see the results of that workshop here, the photos from their activities, their certificates, and the little books that they created. Part of being an illustrator is promoting your work and Ang Ilustrador ng Kabataan helped by creating the annual catalog. This was a compilation of the works of each member every year to be distributed to publishers, clients, agencies, whoever might be able to hire our illustrators. So it started out as something that was just photocopied and spiral bound and it was snail mailed around. And then we went on to experiment with presentation, binding. At one point, we created a CD version. And now we present it in both a printed bound and a digital version so that it's more accessible to all and everybody can see the talent in the organization. Throughout the years, we've been collaborating with different NGOs and publishers as an organization. So what you're going to see here are our books that we wrote, planned, and illustrated as a group. So rather than seeing a single name, credit for the illustrator, you're going to see the logo of Ang Inc. So you'll see here our collaboration with World Wildlife Fund, our collaboration with Canvas, and so many more. We work very well individually, but also work well together. As you go around the exhibit, you'll see all of these larger-than-life characters on the walls, peeking out from the corner. And that's just the wonderful branding done by our members to show how joyful and playful this celebration is. They all have different personalities. I hope you find one that you like best. This is something that's very special. When the organization was founded in 1991, they wrote a constitution, the very first of Ang Inc. And all of the founding members signed the last page. You can see each of their names here. Many of them are still active in our activities each year, but all of them are still loved by the organization. One of the most exciting parts is this mural where you can see evidence of all of our gatherings over our 30 years as an illustration org. So you can see our monthly meetings which were every first Saturday of the month.
where we would hand draw newsletters and people would add whatever they wanted. And then this was simply Xeroxed and then snail mailed around to several members so that it could grow and change with every single delivery. You can see postcards that we drew and uh, passed around. You can see photos from our book fairs, our exhibits. You can even see letters that we wrote each other, merchandise that we created for our events, like these tote bags, which are still available, this t-shirt. And basically, you can see how much love has been poured into the organization over 30 years. We hope you get to visit Ink Story, whether you're a fellow or aspiring artist, a reader, or just a kid at heart. We hope this exhibit helps you to find out what is your Ink Story. Mm -hmm.